Well, spring snowstorms are nothing new to the UP. It seems they happen every year. And the Copper Country is being hit particularly hard this time around. TV6's Sarah Blakely joins us live from the Houghton Hancock Bureau with more on the weather conditions in the Keweenaw. Hi, Sarah. Yeah, Greg, uh, the storm really kind of started around midnight, one o'clock this morning, and it fell the heaviest overnight, but it certainly didn't let up as the day progressed. It may be spring according to the calendar, but youpers know that doesn't mean you're safe from a spring snowstorm. Copper Country residents woke up this morning to a fresh layer of snow, nearly a foot deep in some places, and some are none too happy about it. Miserable. I stayed at my friend's house, so I was really hoping I wouldn't have to shovel, but I still had to help. It is absolutely awful. I feel like I need to go to Florida because it's sunny there. And if forecasts hold up, we could be seeing snowfall overnight and tomorrow as well. Keweenaw County historically gets hit hard over the winter, and as of yesterday, they've recorded a total of 304.5 inches, nearly 50 inches more than this date last year. Residents say this winter has taken its toll, with record-setting freezing temperatures and snowfall and few breaks between storms. I say we had a lot more snow and a lot more cold. Honestly, I'm so sick of it. Spring needs to come. Road crews were kept busy today, too. Heavy wet snow made for sloppy, slippery roadways, especially secondary roads that aren't plowed as frequently. Residents say as soon as they'd finish shoveling, they'd have to start all over again. I got a good arm workout. That's about it. It was awful. But as youpers know, this is just how spring is around here. And though we've mentally checked out of winter and are ready for warm weather, a spring snowstorm isn't unexpected. Though hopefully it's the last of the season. You know, I mean, I live here. I know it's, you're not, it's not a surprise that you're going to get buried with snow in April. So. Yeah, even some native youpers who have lived here their whole life have been telling me all winter that this is one of the worst they've seen in decades. We did break some sub-zero temperatures uh, records um, earlier this year. Uh, we'll see if Keweenaw County keeps that long-standing record of 390 inches back in the 70s. Hopefully, this will be the last big storm of the season. Greg? Well, with the way this winter is going, I wouldn't count on it. All right, thanks, Sarah.